everyone last class you studied about the basic things about a fractions today we are going to learn about a multiplication of fractions addition and subtraction already you studied in the 6th standard so first case fraction by a whole number how to multiply a fraction by a whole number okay so all of you know 1 by 4 is a fraction and 3 is a whole number is it there? so how to multiply a fraction by a whole number so the rule is that you want to multiply the numerator and the whole number and keeping the denominator same okay there is no change in the denominator multiply the numerator with the this whole number so 1 into 3 1 3 is a 3 and the denominator is 4 itself okay so another example 2 by 3 is a fraction and 5 is a whole number so multiply the numerator with the whole number 2 fives are 10 divided by keeping the denominator same 10 by 3 okay so another example how to find out a half of 24 this type of questions are there in the exercise so always this of of represents a multiplication so half of 24 means it is same as half into 24 okay so now you studied a fraction by a whole number multiply the numerator with the whole number so 1 into 24 is 24 divided by 2 so the answer is 12 Okay, so this way you can multiply a fraction by a whole number. Next, we can discuss some exercise problems. Okay, so first question: multiply and express as a mixed fraction. Three into five one by five. Three is a whole number. Five one by five is a mixed fraction. all of you studied how to convert a mixed fraction to improper fraction so 5 1 4 5 1 5 how can we convert this this is a whole number this is numerator and it is denominator so the rule is that 5 1 5 we can write a whole number into denominator Plus numerator divided by denominator. Okay, so five fives are twenty-five. Twenty-five plus one, twenty-six by five. So this way we can convert a mixed fraction. Then here three into instead of five one by five we can write a twenty-six by five. Okay, now this is a whole number and this is a fraction. So just to multiply the numerator with this whole number. So three into twenty six. What is three into twenty six? It is seventy eight. So it is seventy eight by five is the answer. But to express as mixed fraction. So again we can convert this into mixed fraction by the division. Okay. So seventy eight divided by five. So here one five is then two twenty then five five is twenty five. So remainder is three. So how can we write this as mixed fraction? What is the quotient here? Fifteen and what is the remainder? Three. And which number we divide five? So fifteen three by five is the answer. Next question: Find one by two of two three by four. Already we discussed the of means it is multiplication, and this is a mixed fraction that we need to convert. So this one we can write one by two into two three by four. Okay. Then how to convert two three by four? Two three by four. We can write a whole number into 
denominator plus numerator divided by denominator. 2 fours are 8. 8 plus 3 equal to 11. It is 11 by 4. So here instead of 2, 3 by 4 we can write 11 by 4. So here 1 11s are 11 divided by 2 fourths are 8. This is another case of multiplication of a fraction by another fraction. So here you want to multiply the numerator and multiply the denominator. It is simple. Numerators are 1 and 11. So 1 11s are 11. Denominators are 2 4. 2 fourths are 8. So answer is 11 by 8. If we need we can convert this into mixed fraction also. So 11 by 8. How many 8s are here? 1. 1 8s are 8. So remainder is 3. So how to write this as mixed fraction? 1 3 by 8. This is 1 by 2 of 2 3 by 4. Okay. So this way you can practice more questions. Thank you.